guys and welcome back to So Aldo. On today's tutorial, I am going to show you how I made this jean skirt using a thrift store jeans. So if you want to see how, keep on watching. Purposely chose boot cut so I will have um, plenty of fabric to work with just because um, if I use a skinny jeans, it's going to taper and there's going to be less fabric. The first thing I will do is fold the pants like this and I'm going to cut it right here. That is my desired length. When I purchased this, I didn't realize that there was a hole on the knee that limits me to how long I could make the skirt. And then I am going to be using my seam ripper to unpick the inseams and it should look something like this. To make the crotch seam lay flat, I will have to cut a little bit of fabric at a time. Be careful when you do this step though because once you cut the fabric, it is cut and it's going to be tricky to sew it back together. Here is a closer look. As you can see, the cut fabric is under the seam right here. The main idea of what I am trying to accomplish here is I am trying to make sure that the crotch area lays flat. We'll repeat the same step on the back of the skirt. As you can see, I am cutting a little bit of fabric at a time. Then I will smooth it out, making sure that the crotch area is, like I mentioned earlier, it should be flat. So when you're wearing it, the fabric is not puckering up. I will then fold in the seam allowance and I'm going to pin it to secure. And then I'm just going to sew where I place the pin. Same goes on the front of the skirt. And here I am just using a blue thread that matches the fabric. I will repeat the same step on the back of the skirt. Now it's time to patch the massive slits on the skirt. Using the fabric that I cut off from the pants earlier, I'm just going to cut it and I'm going to place it just like so inside the skirt and I'm going to pin it. And then I'm just going to top stitch it. I will repeat the same steps on the back of the skirt. I'll go ahead and top stitch it. I start from the top and then all the way to the hemline. After that, you will have something like this. As you can see, it looks like a nice skirt already. And now it's time to trim off the excess fabrics in the inside and the hemlines. And if you don't like to finish the skirt, you can leave it as is. Toss it in the washer and it will give you that distress and frayed look. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this tutorial. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I post new video every Monday at 5 o'clock in the afternoon, Central Time. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I would love for you to join my So Aldo fam. Don't forget to hit the bell icon so you will get notified whenever I post a new one. So that's it you guys and I will see you next time. Bye!